So, welcome. We're gonna continue Link Between Worlds. Hopefully you're enjoying the playthrough so far. I know I am. As I do quite like this game, despite not remembering much of it. Exceedingly cheery elevator music stopped and Zelda has stopped. What? Zelda has stopped? <laughs> Hello, sir. Are you referring to, like, the song that I was... ...was playing? Because that's, that's from Mega Man. I haven't had coffee. No, fair enough. Fair enough. How's... how's things anyway? Don't judge you at 7am. I would never. <laughs> I'm, I'm not functional at 7 in the morning either. Okay, I mean, much like when I'm streaming and I get tired late, Same thing early in the morning. Oh. I've been in here. Okay. Yeah, I just got back from, uh, hanging out with the family today. Went and saw the Mario movie, and I uh, had some lunch, so it was good. Huh. I wonder how you got in there. Going to a safari park tomorrow. Oh, cool. That should be a lot of fun. I haven't been to anything like that. Um, and we have... I think we have a zoo here that's pretty much like a safari park, but... It's a bit of a drive. I've only been to the, uh, the, the Metropolitan Zoo. Well, enjoy. Kids are already bouncing about it. Yeah, I can imagine. I would be too. Eh, I didn't do it. Or maybe I did. Whatever. I'm just sorry either way. Oh, the thief. Who are you? Did my wife send you to find me? I sealed up the opening nice and tight. There wasn't even a crack, so how'd you get in here? Intuition. You, 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 you're not here to bring me back to the village, are you? Uh, then how about helping me out with something? I mean, if it isn't too much trouble. Okay. Really? So here's the thing. I run the item shop in Kakariko Village. Or uh, I did until I wasted almost all my profits on something dumb. Well, it didn't seem dumb at first. I bought an apple from the street merchant outside my shop. It looked so tasty, I gave him almost every rupee I had. But you'd do the same thing too, right? 
Sure. What? You would? Anyway, about that apple. I ate it right away, right? And it was the best apple ever. Worth every rupee for sure. Unfortunately, my wife didn't th see things that way. She really let me have it. And wow, how my wife can yell when she thinks she's right. Uh, I guess she was right. It was most of our savings after all. So uh, I'm not proud of this. But when I took a lunch break, I just sort of didn't come back. See, that's my sad story. Could happen to anyone. Of course. Really? To anyone? That makes me feel a, a little bit better. You really know what you're doing, don't you? I've been thinking that I've got to hide myself away until I really sort it all out. Maybe in some secluded dungeon, but I know those places are dangerous without the right gear. Like, a scoot fruit. Yeah, I need one of those before I go. Please go get me one. Scoot fruit. I'm early? Uh, a little bit. Just got back from uh, hanging out with the family and watching the Mario movie, so... I'll say hello, Sandy. Uh, am I enjoying playing with normal controls? Yes. <laughs> Not gonna lie, every now and then I do reach for the stylus, because I think it's gonna involve it, and then it doesn't, and I'm content. The hairdryer has gone back into storage as well, so... How did I like the movie? Uh, it was good. I can give a spoiler-free summary thoughts sort of thing. Uh, when everything is said and done, I, I feel a bit better about Chris Pratt's voice in that movie. There's, there's something that um, I guess solidified that I was like, okay, yeah, I can let this go. It's fine. But I mean... The movie is first and foremost a kid's movie, and kids really, really enjoy it. Like, the cinema was just full of kids laughing the majority of the time, so it's a good movie for kids. It's, uh... It's one of those movies where it just goes from scene to scene, reference to reference, like, pretty quickly. But it's enjoyable, like, you know. It's funny. And, uh, there is a lot of attention to detail in it. So, that's my spoiler-free review of it. Just ignore whatever the fuck the credits are saying about this movie. So. We gotta find Gully. I have the strangest feeling. Oh, I don't know. Call it Mother's Instinct. Just keep an eye out for my little guy. Okay, Lunkles? Not seeing a movie, but you're seeing a K-pop concert. Okay. Oh uh, yeah, and uh, I got suckered into. Well, I didn't get suckered, <laughs> but got suckered into. Uh, when I say got suckered, I mean collectively parents and everything. With the popcorn combos, they were putting them in these metallic uh, question mark blocks, so it's a tin. That's a question mark block from the, uh, the games. So, you know, I, I guess we had popcorn and I have a metallic question block tin behind me that I'm going to store my Game Boy games in, so pretty stoked about that. It also came with, uh, like a printed plastic cup, which, that's uh, nice, but it's got logos of the cinema on them. Still decent, but, uh, the tin is, is really nice. And it's just a place to put uh, my Game Boy games in, so I'm happy about that. It's gonna be on my shelf. Welcome to the Cuckoo Round. Come to play with our cutesy little cuckoos? Sure you have. Want to play right away? Of course. Okay, the rules are simple. You Go into that enclosure, and try to dodge them for 30 seconds. Okay. This is different. Oh.
<laughs> this music. I don't know why, it just sounds like a drinking song. I could say thank you for playing. Alright, but that was just egg level. What's next level? Chick. Okay, let's try again. <laughs> Hoping to get match with us tomorrow. Well, good luck. Um, this game might drive me to drinking. I don't know. I love this game. I think... What's gonna keep me sane is just the visuals and it reminds me of uh, my childhood, you know, A Link to the Past, that game, was something I played thoroughly and just loved, so no matter what frustration I might come across, that's gonna always keep me happy. Nostalgia is a very strong thing. This is pro level now. Rooster. Here we go. Hope it gives me a heart piece and it takes me eight hours. <laughs> we'll see. Good gosh, that was some serious dodging there. I guess even roost level was too easy. Well then, I'll prepare a special chat. Oh, come on. Okay, we're done. Cool. It's never going to take me eight hours. This is my comfort zone here. Welcome to Rupee Rush. You have 30 seconds to grab as many rupees as you can. There's no timer. I don't think this one results in a heart piece. Did I beat all of it? I guess. She said one more and then she said forget about it. So let's just see. Endless. I mean, there's no incentive to go to Endless. Endless, I would imagine, is just keep going as far as you can. Um, let's see. A link between worlds, Endless. Puku, what does it give you? I've already got the heart piece, so you know. Okay, so it's just an increasing amount of money. Pretty much for every hundred seconds you stay alive, you get a hundred rupees. That's what endless mode is, which no incentive to do that. I'm good. Um, oh crap, I can't go back. Okay, we'll just do egg again. I just, I, I don't want to do endless. Was that- is this minigame supposed to take a while?
I'm gonna explore town a little. What do you want? Can't a guy just drink his milk in peace? Ah, uh, sorry, don't mean to be a grump. I'm just thinking about magnifying glasses. How I'd read maps with them. But my eyesight's going, and now not even a magnifying glass helps. Everyone in the village is talking about the castle, you know? And how the Elder left his house for the first time in forever. Who knew his <laughs> could walk so far? It's a house thriller. Strange days, people are saying, and they're probably... Wait, strange days, people are saying, and they're probably about to get even stranger. Welcome, just got some fresh milk. Already chilled. Um, no. In these days, you gotta keep your spirits up. A song will do a world of good. How about a song? To go with your milk. Sure. Thanks, my lad. Well then, here we go. Ready to play, little friend? I like that. Hmm. Sorry, little man. My pal's here. He's pretty shy. He flat out refuses to talk in front of people. Hope you don't take it the wrong way. But would you mind leaving him be? Much obliged. Another song? Just 10 rupees. Another one. renditions. Okay. Oh. Disappointing. I can't believe how that quake shook everything. I hope my cuckoos aren't too stressed by all this. Oh, don't forget to eat a good breakfast. Cook eggs are the best to start the day. I am chicken. What quest am I on? Uh, I just finished the uh, Medallion of Courage, so I need to head to Death Mountain. I'm just seeing what, what's around first. See if there's anything I can get heart piece wise. Never stop to think how many times we just pass right on by people on the street, you know, all our life. Well, I know a secret that will make passing by people a lot more fun, because I am in the business of introducing people such as yourself to street. Pa oh boy. Later. I don't carry the DS anywhere, so... That's not gonna be a thing. Shield, please. And, of course... Foul fruit. What was the other fruit the dude wanted? Hang on. Scoot for it. Yeah, this is the one. Alright, so... Yeah, this is the one the, uh, the dude that's... ...hiding from his wife wanted. <laughs> the coward, yeah. Definitely.
Oh wait, it's up here. It's this cave here. I've been thinking that I've got to hide myself away until I really sort it all out. Maybe in a secluded dungeon, but I know those places are dangerous without the right gear. Like a scoop fruit. Please get me one. Well, I see you've got yourself a scoop fruit. Could you let me have that? I really need a scoop fruit. Sure. Thank you so much. Take this as thanks. I mean, sure. With this, there's nothing to be afraid of. There's not, is there? Or is there? Yeah. First, I'll need to gather up the courage to even go into a dungeon. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in? Okay, all better. Huh? M maybe I should just stick around here, or maybe I'll go to a dungeon after all. I don't know, but at least I have the scoot fruit of yours now. That'll be my backup plan. Okay. I mean, just free money, more or less. Alright, I'm gonna head to the mountains, I think. Although, let me pop in here and see if there's anything new. A warm welcome to you, Mr. Hero. I just love the premise of, of Rovio just taking over the house. What? It's barely your, it's barely something you use. You're never here. <laughs> Let me turn it into a shop. See. Excuse me. Another my oh my. <laughs> this game is so good. It is. I mean, the soundtrack comes from, you know, a link to the past primarily, but it's still very good. Now, how's this all going to work? That block's moving between there and there? Gotta time it right. Yeah, that treasure will be mine. thing is for this is I gotta turn up the 3D effect, but I don't like using the 3D effect. Oh. How's this all gonna work? Step on the floor switch, then hit the two round switches. Well, that's simple. I went the wrong way. Hang on. Oh, 
way. Hmm. Okay, that didn't work. Stock. <laughs> Oops. Hmm. What am I missing here? Damn it, I didn't want to do that. I keep, I keep arriving there at the point in time where it, it arrives. Okay, there it is, there it is, there it is. Okay, what have I done here that's wrong? Oh! I need to get up high. Is this not high enough? It's not high enough, so how do I get up one higher? That's the only part I need to solve, is just how to get up a little bit higher. Yeah, this is a bad idea. Hmm. It's gotta be something minor I'm overlooking. I need to be at. Is this going to be a game where I shouldn't care about treasure chests because it's never going to be a heart piece? The heart pieces are just something I'll always see on its own.
Okay. Here's a, here's a question. Aside from sweet potato fries, would you try fries that are sweet? So in other words, they don't use sweet potato. Just standard potato, but the fries are intended to be sweet. Does that sound appealing? Like, let's say they were candy fries, but still potato-based. No? <laughs> I shared it on Discord, um, but apparently in Sydney, this is a thing. They are gummy fries. I, I, I don't know, I don't know what to say about this. But, uh, yeah, apparently a thing. <laughs> Get that stuff off your screen. <laughs> well... I don't know. You know, the funny thing is I didn't look at the thread that, uh, showed what people thought about it. I just got the picture and was like, oh no, this is a... This is definitely comedy fries. They're not... They can't be for real. Chocolate on fries is really good. Yeah, there's, there's some science to it. Chocolate in cooking is common. But goo? I mean, people do the, uh, the pickle in the Snickers. Or the other way around. But I mean, it's just sugar. Colored sugar at that point. Ugh, these rocks, real pain in the neck. Ah, huh, customer. Hey, you're that kid who works for the blacksmith, right? Decided you've had enough of that place, huh? Here to be my apprentice, maybe. Gahaha, <laughs> just joking. I wouldn't do that to your master. I was on the mountain mining ore when all of a sudden the earth started shaking. When I got home, the place was a wreck. Rocks everywhere. You've seen outside. I'll be busting my back for days to clean up that mess. At least picking up rocks and smashing things feels pretty good. Wish they were full of good ore, though. What? You want to try it too? Rah, feel like smashing stuff? Huh? Can't do it. Sorry to hear it. Can't stand to see a nice kid like you not being able to throw your own weight around. Here, take this. It's a hand-me-down from yours truly. Excellent. You'll feel tough with that on your mitt. Or to be able to pick up rocks. Small ones, anyway. And if you get to smashing and just can't stop yourself, well, there's a whole bunch of them outside. Aha, just a joke. That's all. I wouldn't really tell you to do all the work out there. Still, if you do, who am I to stop you? Now these rocks ain't gonna clean themselves. Back to it. And tell that old smithy master of yours I said hello. I feel like, um, those fries might come from a TikTok trend. They feel like it's a TikTok trend. It's like... We don't have peeps in Australia, but I have seen the peep pizza. The peepsa. And these fries just seem like it's trying to mimic that. Except with gummy. because I wonder if 
They'll say anything. Oh no, yeah. Where have all those darned rocks got to? Oh ho! You went ahead and did the job for me. I gotta thank you for all that. Come on, in, okay? Glad to share what's in the chest with you, kid. You earned it. Money? Yeah, okay. <laughs> I got the feeling I'm not gonna be excited for chests in this game. I guess if the heart pace just isn't on the ground, it's not going to be a heart pace. Which, eh, it's a little disappointing. Right, we can we can progress now. Oh, I can't merge onto this wall. That's interesting. Did I complete the Cuckoo Rush minigame on Rooster? I did, yeah. That was what you saw, and you are asking if I was done already with it. <laughs> yeah. That was, that was it. Rock's full of money, huh? Was I supposed to struggle more with it? Was that what was supposed to happen? Was I supposed to be there for at least half an hour? I might want to try again just in case? Why? It says 150 rupees and heart for first completion on rooster difficulty. It's, I did it. And then you unlock endless mode, which I did. I got the heart piece, yeah. You missed the heart piece, okay. I did get it. No, no. She gave me rupees, then she gave me a bonus item. And then I checked if Endless has any rewards and it's just incrementing money. Which, eh. I know I didn't take long. I know I didn't struggle.
Gee, I wonder what's inside that chest. I wonder if it's money. <laughs> okay. Monster guts, fine. Is to be more? Two exits, okay. Money? <laughs> Money is prolific for the kids who die easily and need to buy the items again. Yeah, it would appear that way. I think at the start it was a concern, but once you have a certain number of hearts, it's pretty hard to to mess up that badly. Oh, that's it. I guess the result of this cave was just the money. Oh, I couldn't hang on to the wall there. Okay. Should try the rupee rush game it's fun do you get a heart piece or is it just money because that's the thing is i don't think money is just is gonna matter you get hp okay well if there's a heart piece involved i'll do it But I mean, otherwise, money is just, it's not going to be an issue. Master that made me try and get exactly 10 seconds, yeah? I mean, I did read the description, you get- you have to get 30 seconds, and if you get more, you get nothing. <laughs> 30 seconds would definitely be harder to gauge than 10. If you get it within three seconds to 30, you get a two times multiplier, right. After this uh, area, I guess we can go back and do it. Definitely very, uh, very friendly, because it, it tells you exactly the item you need. Lionel! Ooh, no. Shit, I died. That was greedy. I didn't know that was gonna do that much damage. 
doesn't check if I'm okay, just takes the items. Yeah, I mean, look, I have money, it's fine. Mr. Moneybags here. I should have just run past. Well, I guess I can go do the mini game now. See, that, it just didn't really make much of a dent in how much money I have. I can go teleport there later. Lunkles. Have you seen Gully in here? Wait, did you just find that pouch? Oh my stars, Gully had that. They made it for you so you could carry more items, but he insisted on being the one who gave it to you. If you found it here, then where's my Gully? Oh, how awful. I'd better tell my husband. I'm sure we can find them somehow. We have to. But please, you should use that pouch so I won't have to worry about you quite as much. Oh, right. Okay, double. That's fine. What's what? What sound? I don't know. You'd have to describe it. Keep boomerang bound to X. Probably the item to have constantly. The my oh my sound. <laughs> I, half the time I can't hear it. Like it's just white noise to me. Wait, did I? Okay. <laughs> well, there you go. That was uh, that was my first try. I guess I have a good sense of time. But wait, you get a heart piece for this? How? Do I have to earn a certain amount of money? A hundred. Oof. I just have to stick near the middle. I thought maybe mow the grass. Play. Okay. Okay. 
I wonder if pauses count. We'll see. Hmm, probably could have stuck around a little longer. Yeah. Close. Tiles can be flipped? What do you mean tiles can be flipped? How? Oh, with uh, the wind thing, I see. Okay. I mean, not bad. Not good. <laughs> I think I'm doing a good job just timing it myself. Uh, okay, so let's put wind here. Alright. Yeah, the red needs to come out. For sure. There it is. That's that's quite the start. I seem to be getting it pretty much right on the money. <laughs> like, it's always within one second. Alright, cool. That was pretty lucky. I mean, the red and then two blues right out the gate. That was... It's exactly what needed to happen. Okay, we can go back to where we were now. Were I counting in my head or going by feel? Uh, I was going by, by feel more or less. I think the first time I counted, but then it was more or less wrong. The first couple of times I was definitely counting, but then afterwards I kind of got a feel for it. Because I think, what, the first one was like one second, and then it was three seconds off, so... hate Irene's shadow. What's wrong with Irene's shadow? I gotta pay attention next time. <laughs> that gets sad. Yeah, I'll, I'll watch it next time. Oh, they bounce you up. Would have preferred nothing over what it is. Okay, I'll definitely watch. Hmm, okay.
Oh, I see. Is that gonna work? It did. <laughs> Somehow. Aww. I thought I had it correct. It's not quite high enough. I guess it's pretty safe to say that chests are just largely inconsequential. And that I shouldn't be too concerned if I miss out. Here, there's, it's got to be something minor. I need a little bit more height, but I don't know how to get it. Oh. There we go. Yeah. Still getting used to it. Is it only on 45 degree angles? Yeah. Okay, what about... There we go. I wonder if this dungeon's gonna subvert my expectations <laughs> in terms of what's coming. Hang on. I was looking at the other screen for a sec. I missed this. Ah! Oh! 
off. I got greedy. These things are much quicker in this game. <laughs> that sounds like a pinball machine. I'm already at the point where I'm not that excited about treasure chests anymore. And there aren't heart pieces in dungeons by the looks of it, so... Relax a little. Wait a sec. <sighs> I think the bot's being weird. was a mistake. Fall down. Just fall down. Because then I don't have to redo this. It's just go back. Yeah. maybe
Never mind. <laughs> What would have been cool with this game is if they would have done what they did with, um... Were they bun- what was game- what game was it? I think it was just... On Game Boy Advance it was a, a Four Swords game and then it also came with a Link to the Past. Would have been cool to bundle the original with this. It's fine. <laughs> Lucky. Ah, damn it. So now I, now I must go back. Wait, why, why should I go back? I just realized, why should I go back? Too far. I can't look down. There we go. Prediction. See? Uh, uh, <laughs> I wish it was a heart piece. That would have been a worthy heart piece. Floor. Okay. Hang back here. I knew that was going to be the case at some point. <laughs> I just. Plus that tile there, it usually means that. That was by accident. The other one, completely intentional. Interesting take on the Tower of Hera. Now the big question. Is this what I think it is? Crap. <laughs>
Yep. <laughs> I mean, this is just nostalgia right here. Yeah, that was just autopilot. That was just 100% autopilot right there. Oh, why'd I drop down? Depth perception, it's okay. You got the pendant of power. It makes you feel, well, powerful. Now you have all three and the master sword is calling to you. <laughs> Hear me, Lunkels. You have done well, my young hero. You acquired the pendant of wisdom and the pendant of power. Now that you have all three pendants of virtue, you have proven yourself worthy of the Master Sword. You will find the blade deep within the Lost Woods. Go now, claim what is rightfully yours. Alright, I'm gonna pay attention to the shadow. Why not take a break? barely been an hour. Apparently I don't have Kakarika Village, so that is my bad. Wait, what? Oh, I, s I mean, I, I didn't see her shadow, but I think I know what you mean. Based on what I just saw. to get this. This was another just, oh, autopilot. <laughs> but I should have walked to this thing right away. Bottle. I'll just buy the milk now. <laughs> what, you again? You banged me, banged into me at the Zora cave. I don't have the the boots. So I cannot catch this crook. Seals. Oh, 
Oh. I should have been prepared for that. Well, it's, I'm glad to see that this is still the same. The question is, is this? It's not. Okay. I love this music that's about to play. Thank you. So, you know, I've already got quite a few hearts. Oh no. I'm gonna have to lift up rocks. I wasn't aware these things could be on the rocks. This really is this game's Korox. Welcome to the Lost Woods. These woods will trick you into going back the way you came. But all hope is not lost. If you can follow me, then you can walk a little deeper into the woods. Watch carefully. Did I get it wrong? I got it wrong right away. <laughs> okay. Watching more carefully this time. done. That was fun, but now we're going to mislead you. Two of us will bounce around. So don't follow the two of us or you wind up back at the start. Think you can get it right? Two of us will bounce around. What do you mean two of them will bounce around? I don't know what that meant. I'm gonna pick north. Okay, cool. Let's start again. <laughs> oh no, it worked. Oh, very well done. Hmm, I guess it's really time to stump you. Three of us will bounce around, don't follow us. I don't know what it means by bounce around, but whatever. <sighs> Damn it.
I don't get what it means by bounce around. First one's easy, it's just... Two of us will bounce around, what the f What does that mean? I watch them and I can't... Three of us will bounce around, don't follow us. I still don't- I don't- I don't get it. This is just- this is just like a guess. It's a one in three chance, like at this point I, I just have to guess. Because I don't know what it means by visually when they bounce around. They're bouncing around here, like what, what do you mean bounce around? Unless it's a 3D, oh my god it might be a 3D thing. Let me crank the 3D up. It's still not any clearer, even with the 3D on. This is not any cl I don't get- I'm gonna have to look this up. I don't get what I'm looking for visually. And I've turned the 3D on. I thought maybe some of them would jump higher. But it's not the case. I don't know what I'm looking for visually here. It's not- it's not clicking. No, but it says bouncing around. It says two of them will bounce around. Don't follow the two that bounce around. But what does that mean visually? This one is just follow the, the one that talks, which is easy. Right? That, that one goes to the right. So I know that one. So this one... Okay, the instructions... Two of us will bounce around. What does that mean visually because it all just looks the same 
Watch. Don't follow the two of us. If it means literally those two... Okay, I'm following the one that was top center right now. Okay, so the top center went to the left. That one wasn't the, one of the two. Three of us will bounce around. I just, I followed the one, I followed the one that wasn't jiggling that time and it was wrong. I'm following it with a pen. I put, I put my stylus on the one that wasn't jiggling. So this one, you follow the one that's, I'm following this one. Because a jiggler went there. Ah. That might be what I'm doing wrong. Yeah, this is annoying. I turned the 3D off since it's no, well, I'll turn it down, but not off. What? Yeah, I was gonna say they all went in a direction. The only way is back. Ugh. This is just straight out of A Link to the Past. You got the Master Sword, a blade for a true hero. It fires a beam when you're at full health. <laughs> Hear me, Lunkles. The sword you hold in your hand is the one and only Master Sword. Now that you possess the blade, you can break the barrier at the castle. So make haste. We don't have much time left. Get to Hyrule Castle. Single set over there. The music's dramatic. This is just the standard overworld theme, isn't it? I mean, a modern rendition of it, but classic overworld theme nonetheless. Hmm. 
Aha, no doubt that is the very blade of Bane's evil. You have found the Master Sword. Well done, Lunkles. Now there is no time to waste. Strike down this nefarious barrier. Why, that's incredible. How easily it cuts through dark magic. Come now. To action, you must find Princess Zelda at once. But it seems before such a fateful moment to save. Shall I do that for you now? Okay. Complete out. Uh, before I do. Didn't forget about this. Did you say chat that there's a Mai Mai? Uh, I mean, am I actively hunting them down at the moment? Not really, but... If there was one outside... It is a bit subtle. The thing is, sometimes I hear it, but then you can't reach it. And that's because I missed one, so. No. <laughs> I didn't? Okay. I'm kind of aware of it. So far. A little disappointing, but that's not a thing. Restricts you from touching the walls. Interesting. I love this theme. Why did it restart it? <laughs> oh wow, this is like almost identical.
Oof, this is... This dude has way longer of a reach than before. Power of milk to heal me. And I don't have to okay, I do now. being rather stingy on the hearts at the moment. Your rampage through my kingdom must stop, you go. How many more of my people do you intend to take? <laughs> my little acquisition tour of Hyrule is nearly over, princess. It was quite a spree. A sage here, a sage there, and now you're Impa too. I've already got all seven sages. What do you plan to do with them? Never mind. Never you mind. For I have one more painting to make, so please rid your mind of all concern. I don't want your portrait to feature any unsightly, unsightly worry lines. I wish to preserve you at your very best. I dare say you're a match even for her grace. Confess it, monster. You're, you plan to use our seven sages to revive Ganon, don't you? Ah, uh, what golden hair you have. Such bright locks. And normally far too sunny for my tastes. But for you, I'll make an exception. You're not even listening to me. I find your protests inelegant, not to mention irrelevant. I wish... To only, I wish only to possess your beauty, Princess Zelda of Hyrule. Not all these ugly words of yours. Oh, you're going to make for a spectacular painting, my dear. <laughs> ah, my lovely masterpiece, how utterly scrumptious. Dare I say, it's my best work ever. Ooh. 
What's that? You! Didn't I splash you on some wall somewhere? How'd you get out? How impudent. Emerging? Foisting your imperial form upon my eyes? I will not tolerate this. You should have remained nothing but a stain on that wall. But I will be glad to leave you here once and for all. <laughs> okay. I need to go boomerang. Stop. I do like how this dungeon looks with the verticality. What a beautiful masterpiece. My talent is almost frightening. And then there's you, Worm. I can barely bring myself to look at such an inferior creature. And yet, it seems there's more to you than meets the eye. How did you manage to escape that wall? Never mind. I don't have time to listen to your prattle. I have what I've come to Hyrule for, so I refuse to let you delay my departure any further. <laughs> Farewell for the last time! <laughs> I love that they bring singing into this. pissed. Once you get him, you just can't let him go, just keep following him. <laughs> I 
God, I bore of this fight. Once I have released Ganon, lowly creatures like you won't be worth my time. That's uh, definitely a throwback. Oh, too late. <laughs> one of the best themes will start. <laughs> You've arrived just in time. A splendid collection, don't you think? All seven sages and Zelda herself, but even they pale in comparison to my next artful creation. <laughs> Me? I will use the sages to reach the one who shall help me attain true beauty. I mean, of course. Get him! Behold the Triforce of Power! Join with me. Let us destroy all ugliness in this world or any other. We shall truly be superior. Hero of Hyrule, I can hold the beast at bay for only so long. It should prove enough time to bid you a most sorrowful welcome to my kingdom. Welcome to Low Rule. My name is Princess Hilda, and I have failed you in every way. I knew Yuga planned to slip into your world to abduct Zelda and the sages. I, I couldn't stop him. Now, he has used them to summon the Demon King and siphon his power. Yuga's appetite will soon consume our worlds, Hyrule and Lowrule. The beasts for the taking. I cannot hold them back much longer, so I must see you to safety. Here we are. A moment more of safety, Lunkles. Though Yuga is slipping his bonds, I will try to keep you safe from him as long as I can. 
I'm afraid I must ask you to do what I cannot, defeat the beast. To do that, you must awaken your full potential, Hero of Hyrule. I sense that the paintings of Hyrule's seven sages are being sent to the far corners of Lowrule. You must steal those paintings back. The secret to Yuga's defeat lies in uniting your friends. Farewell, Hero of Hyrule. We shall meet again. How does this kid expect to survive two seconds in low roll if he's... Well, 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 look at this. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I wake you? How was your nap? Don't even know why I brought you back. Should have just left you there, passed out in the middle of the road. Now that you're awake and I see you're okay, you can see yourself to the door. Go on now, scoot. <laughs> can you hear me, Hero of Hyrule? It is I, Princess Hilda. I wanted to warn you about the kingdom which you have found yourself. My low rule may remind you of your own home, but in fact, our kingdoms are as different as night and day. Worlds apart, they say. But Yuga's scheme has forced our two kingdoms close together. So close, they are now connected. What's more, the seven sages you seek are spread across my land, locked away in dungeons. But because parts of low rule have long crumbled away, you cannot get them from where you are now. To reach them, you must fi first find a way back to Hyrule. From various parts of your world, you can reach the same parts of mine. Now, one more thing. I have welcomed you to low rule, but my kingdom? It isn't so welcoming to strangers. Farewell and be careful out there, Lunkles. Are you really running around the sword? Hang on, I, need, I don't want to talk to you. I want to hear this. Best theme. Ugh, I love this theme so much. The modern rendition of it is just great. Okay, now I can read. Are you really running around with a sword like that? Sheesh. I pour my heart and soul into crafting fine weapons, and folks just battle whatever they find lying around. Okay, I'm gonna go with Al. If you're looking for some easy treasure, you're in the right spot. I call this fortune's choice. Okay. Piece of heart? Sure. Okay. When I played A Link to the Past, I tried to guess it. So let's see if we, I can get it right. But if you want to pick for me, I can allow that too. I'll do it first. I mean, not bad wasn't what I was looking for. Almost. I still, uh, I'm up. I wasn't trying to walk it, I was trying to get here.
Oh, that's not good. Damn. I was one off again. Why am I always one off? I always pick the one next to it. Maybe I should go with... I'll... Think of one to pick, and then I'll pick the one next to it. Okay. Hey, yeah, yeah, and I thank you for the raid. How's it going? Okay. I'm gonna pick this one, and then I'm gonna go to the one next to it. Okay, I'm gonna pick... This one, and I'm gonna go to the one next to it. Wow. This one, and then the one next to it. <laughs> I can't believe that worked. Thanks a lot, come again. Early raid, indeed. Hello, is it Twitch yet? I'm up to a link between worlds now. Many years ago, I felt so free. Thought I chose the thief's life, but it really chose me. Every time I say I'm a leaving, this accursed life sets me right back to thieving. Oh, hey there, little guy. Sorry, I was just singing out loud. It's an old tune. You probably wouldn't know it. What do you think of this place? A little too rough here, yeah? I don't mind it so much. At least there's uh, still a strong musical culture in this town. It's a tradition with us. I am Skull. I am Rupee Head. <laughs> oh. There we go. Whoa. Ended up in someone's house. E, how in, how in Hyrule did you get in here? My door is locked, Lunkles. Well, never mind. I'm actually glad you popped in. I was just admiring my new dress. What do you think of it? Glamorous, isn't it? Oh, you're too kind. Very sweet of you. So here, take this as thanks. <laughs> nice. I'll leave the door open. So you're welcome to pop in. Well, I did find a way back, so. I was not expecting that. Uh. <laughs> Hello, weird Gus. Okay, there's nothing... Thought maybe something new would be on offer, but no. I reckon. Wait, what is this? Oh, it's the B person. Buzz buzz, Loonkles. Great to see you. Huh? Don't you remember me? I've been catching bees since way back in the day. Well, I guess I've changed a bit. Takes a bee to see a bee. So I've become a different person. Now every buzzy calls me the bee guy. So just between us, I wonder if you'll do me a favor. <laughs> I want you to catch bees for me. You can keep them nice and safe in bottles. What, you don't have a net? Because you're helping me out, I'll give you one of mine. Spending my days surrounded by a buzzy swarm of bees has always been my fondest dream. So use that net to gather up some bees, if you please. Of course, I'll reward you for being so helpful. Oh my god. <laughs> well, I have a net now. 
Wait, is this a treasure game as well? People have been going missing, just up and vanishing. Who's going to be next? Well, anyway. Welcome to Fortune's Choice. First and simple, there is... Okay, reveal two chests. You can open... You win 100. No, so this one's just the money one. I'm good. You just want to be? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> the puns are spreading! Hello, Messiah. How's it going? Wait. Uh, nah. I need to drink the milk, unfortunately. Put it in the bottle. Okay. I mean, I'll, I'll take it back right away and let's see what happens. I kind of have to. I'm gonna hate coming here. <laughs> Wasps that? You found one? I couldn't be more delighted. Wow, look at that bee's sheen. She's the bee's knees. Here's my way of saying thanks. Take this, buzz buzz. You're a real pro at catching bees, Linkles. But I wonder if you can find the most bee coming of bees, the golden bee. I've never seen one before. If you can bring me one of those, I'd, well, be very generous. <laughs> this is someone that's dressing up as a bee. It's not a, a real bee person. I guess I just have to keep doing this. I wonder if it's random or if there's a specific spot to find it. Have another B. Okay, so every time I catch a B, it's 50 rupees. I guess I'll know when I find the golden one. Oh, that's useful, the, the map flicking thing. I mean, I, I don't want to base this off a <laughs> link to the past, but... Oh, there we go. Dun, 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 dun. Ah, I should have gone a little further. Now, how's all this going to work? Maybe jump off the ledge? Oh, better be holding a cuckoo. That's right. That's the important part. Yeah, then the treasure will be mine. Oh, but it's just money. I mean... Alright. Whoa! What? What happened there? The chicken landed on the spot that I was supposed to land. No, it's it's this 3D thing. <laughs> it's just this isn't worth it. It's not a heart piece. I don't care. It's just gonna get me a hundred rupees, and I already have two thousand. Okay, I'm 
going back through here again. There we go. I'm gonna go again. Is that a golden bee? I can't tell. No, it's just a normal bee. <laughs> I assume it's just gonna say golden bee the moment I catch one. Alright. Let it be? I did. No, come on. There we go. That's uh, just money. It's only one that's gonna be. <laughs> Damn it. Now I hate saying the word B, but like, how else am I going to express what I want to express without using the word B? My little Octorok is bringing the heat. If you can manage to score 100 rupees, I'll give you something special, kid. Oh, this is baseball. Hey, bada 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 bada, welcome to the Octoball Derby. 50 rupees per game. Want to play? All right. Atta boy, batter boy, you're on deck. Here we go. 30 pitches coming at y'all. I don't get how, um, how do you aim? This just seems completely random. How the heck do you aim in this? I have no idea how to aim in this. Early swings go left. That is, uh, that is not very intuitive. I need to get 50. How does stance affect it though? I don't know what to say about this. this is... The fact that you can't aim, it's just... I might have to read how this works. It, it didn't even explain it either.
But what constitutes light? Or the bolt. Yeah, I don't know. Why can't it just be a direction? But then how do you get height? I can't get it to go far left. There we go. Wow, that missed. Okay. I don't know, I would much rather it be just, I don't know, something normal, like pressing a direction on the analog stick to pick where you're, you're hitting the ball. I don't know what I did there to do that, but okay, cool. This is definitely the, the worst controlling minigame I've seen in the Zelda game. Whatever, I'm over, I'm over 50 now, so it doesn't matter. Kinda locked out with the birds. You got 59. You set a new record. Congrats. No. Didn't he say I'd get a reward? Hang on. What was the record that I need to play? Maybe it was more. I don't like this early light thing. It also appears to be up to RNG, because there's no birds this time, so what, am I just screwed out of getting the reward because there's no birds? I'm going to see if there's a heart piece associated with this. If there isn't, I'm leaving it.
100 equals a heart piece. Fuck. <laughs> I don't like this minigame. The main objective of the game is to score as many rupees as possible and using 30 pitches. During the game, the player can adjust Link's pose by moving circle pad up or down. Each pose results the ball in being hit in different stances. In the up stance, Link is going to hit ground ball, which is the only way to hit in front of a row of pots, but can also hit octo. In the down stance, going to hit fly balls. I, I ascertained that. That's fine. But the part that I don't like is to hit left or right. Really? Like, it's just swing early or late? That's the part that just, I think, is clunky. That's the part that I don't like. Because you can't control how much to the left and how much to the right. That's the part that I don't like. It, there's no fine control over this. It's just... I'm trying to hit that yellow pot. That's how many attempts it took to hit that. Yeah, I don't know, man. This I don't like this mini game at all. I think this is. Not the best choice, in my opinion. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure I can get it, it's just... I'm still gonna state my opinion on it, which is... I think this is a poor choice of control scheme. I can't get it to hit to the left. Wow, that was a... Uh... to get that bird. I mean, it was better. Birds come if you had three in a row. Alright, well. It just frustrates me because I don't have fine control over this.
Uh, I mean, there's no point. You just miss. I know how to hit the bird now at the edge reliably. It's just this shit. <laughs> I can't get down. If I can get if I get this down, then I'll have no problems. It's just beginning was amazing yeah but like when it comes to hitting certain ones i just i couldn't figure it out break the streak, okay, well. See, what the problem I have is when it gets up to this point where there's not many pots remaining, this is where it's just, it sucks. When there's plenty of pots out there, no worries, it's just the last, the last part of it. <laughs> I just can't get it down. Alright. Stuff. I, you know, I'm trying my hardest to aim for that yellow pot, but I just, I just can't do it. that happen sooner if that happened sooner it'd be fine
Aim for the higher clusters. Yeah, but like... I'm, I'm still not... I'm not 100%, because it's, it's a timing thing, that's the problem. It's got nothing to do with me aiming, it's, it's a timing thing, I'm just not getting the timing right. That's the problem I'm having. It's all well and good, say aim, but it's not as simple as aiming, it's getting the timing right to aim. That's the problem. Like, I want to aim for that bird right now, but timing's wrong. And that's why I don't like this. I just want to hit something on, on the right-hand side right now. It's like, oh, early but not early enough. Oh, yep, it's way too early. Nope, not early enough. Yeah, I don't like this minigame. <laughs> I will do my best to finish it, but my opinion of this minigame is that I don't like it. I understand how it works. I understand what I need to do. I just don't like how it controls. the bird hurts yeah but it's it comes down to a timing thing this isn't about aim it's just about timing and the other thing is why does it reset sometimes and then other times it doesn't does anyone know like how can i get it to reset the pots because it it does it sometimes other times it doesn't do it the crabs reset it. I'm gonna need to aim for the crabs. to be three in a row. Oh. <laughs> yeah. 
The strategic crab reset is the way to go. I'm gonna get it, but uh, it's, no, it's not gonna change how I feel about the minigame. Oh, come on. Yeah, absolutely not. Oh wait, it's not quick minigame, it's quick game. Uh oh. That's a problem. <laughs> um, look, I haven't really progressed, so it's okay. I already I, I already know what I what I did. It's okay. I, I know exactly what I did. There's no there's no need to stress. Thankfully that wasn't like two hours of progress. Oh I can Link, can you please go back to where you were? Heat of the moment. Yeah but I just got annoyed. <laughs> I got tilted, I was like, no, this is pointless, I'm stopping. Okay, blah, 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 how'd you get in here? Do you like my dress? Okay, here, kisses. Okay. Oh wait, I did the B thing as well, didn't I? Yeah, okay, just catch one B. I don't believe it! You're back here! hear it, I just don't see it. It might be in here, as in other side. Don't tell me it's, it's buried there. But I don't have a shovel. Do I have the sand rod? Oh. Right. <laughs> That's... Does that one dick still have it? Probably. Rented ice rod, rented fire rod. I don't have a sand rod. I mean, I haven't checked back. Maybe it's available, but... There it is. This wasn't, this wasn't that important, but it's just to get the golden thing. I mean, I, I understand the my 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 acute. I get it. I hear it again. I almost don't want to do it because I don't have all the items. Like, I need Pegasus boots. I need a way to dig up soil. Oh, 
a lot of the Maya Maya in a tree. Yeah. That's what I mean. You need Pegasus boots. So I almost don't want to bother until I get Pegasus boots. It's okay. This one I, I won't forget. Right, is that golden? No, it's not golden. Okay. And yes, I hear it, don't worry. <laughs> Back to this. Will it say golden bee? Yeah, I would assume so. Make it go left. Adjusting the 3D. <laughs> you know, this this mini game I've been here for at least 20 minutes now. Is this going to be my my one hour heart piece? It might be. Oh my god. No. Nah. Oh, this is, uh, this is going nowhere. <laughs> Turning the 3D off, it's not helping me right now. I'll turn it back on when I get to a dungeon. I hate this so much. Okay, 
I tried to get an early swing in. That was never gonna happen either way. <laughs> Even if I would have landed that, I would have had an aneurysm because I would have been one off. This one's, this one's a complete wash. Oh my god. I just hate the fact that I have to purposely swing light just to make it go in a certain direction. Honestly, what's keeping me sane is the fact that this game is reminding me of A Link to the Past. That is what is allowing me to have patience with this and not get too annoyed. <laughs> it's just the connection to one of my favorite games. It is most definitely keeping this afloat. Sweating on that last ball. My hands are actually sweaty. Ugh. <laughs> Jeez. Okay. We can move on. Ah, thank you. I still don't like the mini game, but thank you. Yeah, that was like. Not caving to pressure. All right, I'm gonna I'm going to go save before I accidentally exit the game again.
Who's there? Nobody gets past me unless you know all the words to the ultra secret thief password song. I'll start with the lyrics and you finish them. Here we go. A smart face to bears the bothrass. I'd rather be walking on a cliff, walking on. Okay. Sometimes it hurts too much to care. You think knowledge is power, but it's really despair. I guessed. 100% <laughs> guessed. Never seen you around here before, but you're one of the new recruits, eh? Perfect timing. You can take over here on guard duty for me. Have fun, but don't do nothing that'll get me in trouble. Fresh meat. All right, I'm going to go get some fresh air. Fresh meat, fresh air. <laughs> so that's kind of catchy. Maybe I'll see if the bard can put a tune to that. Fresh meat, fresh air. I don't know if I should be here. Yeah, the, the worst thing to happen here would be to die, so... Okay. Wait. Boomerang. And then do that. Alright, let's go. I still haven't saved. Looks like it's two switches. I mean, it's possible I can't do this. I think I can't do this. I don't want to go with the obvious choice, but I think I'm just going to have to go to the palace, I think it is. Yeah, that doesn't work. So obviously you have to use that to get across. And there's no way down. It's okay. I mean, I have the entrance figured out. <laughs> I'm capable of it. Well, I want to save first. I would hate for a disaster to happen. What items do I have then? But I don't have anything to deal with the dual switch system. Thank you. 
Okay, there's no just place down. Oh, can I pull these? Yeah, okay. That's all it is. I just kind of assumed I couldn't move them. I just assume it required the red cane. <laughs> Again, Link to the Past, just... clouding my judgement a little. Huh? That's on it, right? This is the third button, so yeah, there is, okay. Of course there is. So that baseball game was an hour, right? Like, <laughs> roughly. <laughs> uh... I suppose it's not the worst heart piece I've had to get. I think that, that hands down goes to Minish Cap's uh, gotcha. not. Think outside of what I'm used to. I could have just shot that with an arrow. No, wait, no, it's a conveyor belt. Never mind. Why do I, what? Why would I? Oh. Is this, why is this something? Hmm. I'll figure that out later.
Who are you supposed to be, and how'd you get in here? Hang on a second, you wouldn't happen to be looking for some kind of painting, would you? I knew it. That must be pretty valuable if the boss went to all that trouble just to hide it. And now folks are searching for it? Hmm, well, I may have accidentally learned where the boss hid it. Maybe. That's why the creep locked me in here. Can you believe that? Say, we could help each other out here. If you could get me out of here, then maybe I could help you find what you're looking for. Maybe. So get going. I don't want to spend any more time than I have to down here. No maybes about that one. I just wonder if this is going to culminate in a fake out. <laughs> the original dungeon is, you know, you get... You rescue someone, and then they end up being the dungeon master. Oh, okay. helpful. Why didn't I get this? <laughs> ah, it's just that. Fine. I don't know, I thought maybe it led to a lower floor. What's the point of that room? You can't assume that the hole means it's, uh, that it's gonna cause you damage. It could be leading to a lower floor. You have to rule that out. I'm gonna hate this, aren't I? The longer something takes to figure out, the more likely that I've missed something minor. Reminds me of this study that was done where if you put someone in a room where the only thing to do is press a button that shocks them, they'll just keep pressing the button. <laughs> Sounds about right. Maybe I just, just need to go to another floor, I don't know. I don't see any keys. Just go visit the other chests. 
There's one straight ahead, but I just don't know. I think I need to go further below. I can't really see any other... any other thing I can do here. What's this? Oh, see, that's the chest that I need to get. I need to be higher. Okay. That's the big chest, so I shouldn't worry about that. There's no way to get to a higher height here. Did I get a map? I have not gotten a, a map, no. I mean, the map is there on the bottom screen. I don't know. Right now, I need to find just a standard key. But see, it has verticality to it, so I can just drop. Maybe that's the key to the puzzle. Okay, I think I get it. I just need to look down at all times. See, I can't drop here. This is the part where I need to drop. Okay. No, but you can't. You can't. It doesn't let you. I thought I was onto something here, but there's no way down. And I need to get down there. It's odd to get the compass before the map. It does happen. heck is the point of this room? Just making sure I didn't already have the key, because that's, like, next level stupid if I did. Is there anything I can drag along? There's nothing I can drag to that spot either. There's a door, hang on, there's a door this way. Maybe that's the, I think that's the secret. Hold up. Maybe I was onto something there. Yeah. Hmm.
Why is this a thing? I'm sure I'll find that eventually, but... I'm trying literally everything. <laughs> Crack in the wall, maybe this is bombable. I doubt it. No. Nope. If I could just get past the spot, I'd I'd get it, but Talk to the dude again in case there's something. No. Nope. So I'm kind of st stumped here. <laughs> well, the only explanation is like unless there's a cane item that lets you put a block on the ground. I don't know how else you're supposed to do this. I tried dropping from above, but there's no way that I could see you could drop from above. The goal is to unlock the dude. I uh, yeah, hang on. Okay. I get the feeling it's something to do with the top floor. I just hate that it's taking me this long to figure this out. Well, I get the point of the, the switches, it's just I need access to them. Wait a minute. Can I do... Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Does this work? Ma... I thought that was going to work. The explosion doesn't persist. Oh, man. The only other thing... There's a crack in the wall as well. That's what I'm trying to ascertain is like where that is. It's... What the fuck? It's not really in a spot that's accessible. I don't know, this almost seems like I'm missing an item and I can't progress any further. This is just classic, like, I'm missing an item that lets me activate two switches at once. I need- I need something with white, and I just don't- there's nothing there, so... The only thing that it leads me to believe is there's no... Yeah, I don't know. This 
is going to be an annoying answer. But why doesn't that work specifically? I guess because it's going down too many floors. No. Nope. Doesn't even work going down one floor. I'm going back down there. I don't think I can drag statues from room to room. room I want to investigate. I mean, I assume it's it's got to be this one. thing. See, the problem is you can't control flight here. <laughs> oh, this is giving me a headache. I can't believe you can't hit this, like what? It seems like a- oh my god. Okay. Well. That was, uh, that was quite the blind side. That was a waste of, uh, 20 minutes. is this? I'm gonna die if I don't- yep. They're taking two hearts from me. Wow, that's uh... <sighs> well, I have to go back to my house though. Yeah, it took longer than it needed to, but okay.
So I'm gonna go buy milk. Seems like I'm gonna need it here. I can hear it. That's why I was smacking pots to see if it was something obvious. Seems to have gotten further away. It's probably on the back of the house. Yeah, there it is. I hear another one. Definitely hear it. Assume that one's in a tree. Anyway. Uh, uh, I'm not happy with <laughs> how long that took me to find. That's the sort of thing that causes internal screaming if you've played this game before and know what to do. Just how many times I would have walked past it and just not turned in. Thought the answer would be vertically. Yeah, me too. I thought when I was throwing the bomb down that, uh, that was it. That I was going to hit the switch from above and then I could get in there. I thought I had it when I did that. All oh, right, I think it's this one. All right, it's okay. Let's move on. Uh, it was this house, wasn't it? Yeah, I can, I can hear it. I think it's the one probably buried in the sand, but I don't have a sand rod. No questions asked about me going into a closet. Dun 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 Oh good, everything's reset. I 
can't believe this ended up being a crawl space. Treating this like the tile. I do have the lantern. But I mean, I think I got the right there. Ah, oh, it's these assholes. It's alright, I mean, th this is a fine strategy as well. This is working. a lot of effort. I keep forgetting that I'm playing with regular controls and not a stylus. Yeah. Alright, we're here. The painting you look for is hidden on the outskirts of town, I'll take you to it. By the way, did you learn how to slide in and out of the walls like that? That's a bit creepy. Where'd you learn? Maybe you can teach me how to do it. Hey, what are you doing? Take me outside? We're locked in, check that northern door, see if we can get out that way. Okay. I don't understand the rationale here. There's so many buttons on the DS. Why couldn't they make it L or something like that? I know R's shield. There's more of that came from, or even just a touch screen. Like, why not? Plus, I'd be getting in the way. I'm hung so hungry, starving, actually. You know, I'm weak and feeble, so... So on. <laughs> Am I actually asking for touchscreen controls? Ah, oh, man. Hmm. No. 
No. <laughs> The audio is shifting when it's in walls. Yeah, it's pretty good. Hmm. I'm so worried that I'm just gonna get stumped again. <laughs> it's just... I mean, it's to get... This is to get him across, so hang on. Okay, what is this? Oh, this. Duh. Okay. <laughs> Not a swimmer? Okay, not a swimmer. At least that looked visually cool. Saves me some effort. Ah, oh, crap. Blows. Oh, no, okay. Alright, I don't have to repeat everything. Let's just walk there. That's... I mean, don't get me wrong. I'd rather it didn't do that, but it could have been worse, I guess. I'd have to do all this again. So, silver lining, don't have to do everything again. Hey. 
It's not too bad. Okay. Well, now that I've seen that boomerang is coming to the forefront. Okay, that's what that's for. the other way. There we go. Oh. Now I have to... Okay, stay... Yeah, no, fine. Stay there. by friends. Stay in the corner. Yeah, great AI. We're cut off. That big door is our only way out of there. Hope you got that key, kid. The only thing that I haven't resolved is how to get this. I mean, it doesn't matter, because it's not like it's a heart piece. <laughs> it's not going to be a heart piece. So I guess I shouldn't care too much. Gow, what gives? Ah, silly girl, do you actually think I'd let you escape if you're a little hero? Wow. Oh, 
no. ahead. Okay, um, just in case, it's on, it's on quick button. I don't think I'm gonna need it, but just in case. Alright, cool. Took too long. Cool boss, but I'm disappointed in myself a little bit. Wow, looks like you got rid of him. Good riddance. Let's go, that door will lead us out of this place. Yeah. You're looking for that painting, yeah? That one of the kind of younger elder looking fella? I'll show you where it's hidden. Come on, follow me. This is the one, right? Don't see what the big deal is. What's so special about this painting? Hmm, actually, now that I look at it, it is kind of interesting. I really like the whole flat kind of look going on there. It's almost like he just walked right into the painting and got trapped there, you know? Listen to me. Getting all wrapped up in a painting. Anyways, thanks for getting me out of the dungeon. See ya. Where am I? You, the blacksmith's apprentice. What are you doing here? And with the master sword, no less. That can only mean you rescued me? But I always thought that I was the hero of our day. That I was the one who'd be there for Princess Zelda. It seems that I'm only a sage and not the hero. How very odd, yet I know my place in all of this. So I pledge my support to your quest, little hero. Thanks for saving me, Lunkles. Now please find the rest of the seven sages before it's too late. Ah, I suppose you're the hero. Then you have more need of this sand rod than I have. There you go. That's, that's the sand rod. I wish I could give it to you as a gift, but truth be told, it's not mine. It belongs to a merchant named Ravio. I rented it, and the deal was, if I fell in battle, well, never mind. I need to get back to him. I seem to be stuck here. So return this for me, would you? You got the sand rod, but you'll have to return it to Ravio. At least then you can find it in his shop. Okay. Wow, that thing just does not waste time. It's already here to collect. I don't need this to happen every time.
Wait. Oh no, never mind. I thought I saw something. It's okay. Oh, Mr. Hero. One of my other customers finally returned his rental item, and here it is. The sand rod! Wonder what it does. Well, you'd better snatch it up quickly then before someone else gets it first. Okay. Make sure you take good care of my sand rod, alright? Oh, I will. Now we can probably find that thing in the town. <laughs> it does that too often, but this time I'm gonna pay attention to it. Chat, we're gonna take a small intermission. I wanna refill my water bottle, but also stretch. It's been... Almost four hours, so pretty long stretch so far. Um, so I'm gonna refill my water bottle and uh, just stretch for a couple of minutes, but we will continue. So don't go anywhere, get a snack or something, and uh, I'll be back in a couple of minutes. Shouldn't be too long, but we shall continue. Uh, if you're watching this later on YouTube, though, this is where the journey ends for now but I do hope you've been enjoying it so far. Alright. Bye, YouTube.